Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Martine and I'm doing a reading for Leo right now, Leo Sun Moon or Rising. So if you have any of those placements in your chart, there could be a message here for you. All right, before we get started, before we do anything else, I'd like you to like, hit the like button. Okay, subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And just to let you know, if you see the scroll at the bottom of the screen, if you'd like to book a personal reading with me, you can do that at martinefelton.com. All right, so where you currently are at, Leo, you are healing. You're healing from um, a relationship. I have the star, the knight of cups, and the king of swords. So I feel like some of you are healing from a relationship from this knight of swords. Okay, I don't think you're the knight of swords. I feel like the person that you're healing from is the king, I mean, from the king of swords. Um, healing from a relationship, a love, someone who professed their love to you. Um... But I feel like it probably like it didn't work out and your it just didn't work out and you're healing from this relationship. This person is the king of swords. Um, they're an air sign. Let's get it, let's get some more cards so we can go deeper. The Knight of Pentacles, another knight. People moving towards you. Leo, or this could be you, slowly but surely working, okay, slowly but surely, this is turning out to be a love reading, I'm sorry, because we have the Knight of Pentacles and then with the lovers, all right, so there's definitely some sort of slow moving process towards love right now. I feel like you you're out of you were healing from about from another relationship but there has been this slow moving process going towards love your soulmate. Okay, so if you felt if you've broken up from a relationship, you know, this is general. It's not going to be for every Leo, but um if you've broken up from a relationship and you're he you've healed from it, you're moved trying to move on with your life. And now they're, you're moving towards another relationship, a soulmate relationship, or possibly a twin flame relationship that I feel like you've been manifesting it. You've been, and so that's what's happening. You're slowly moving towards another relationship, but this is going to be a really intense, a soulmate, twin flame type relationship where um, it's going to be intense. There's going to be a lot of love. It's going to be deep. The connection is going to be very deep. Can we get some guidance for Leo? Let us get some guidance for Leo. Okay, so we got three. Nine of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, and the Knight of Swords. Okay, wish fulfillment, abundance, communication. So I feel like this this um this connection that you're slowly moving towards, this deep, deep lovers connection that you're so you're you've been manifesting this for a while, and now it's finally going to happen. You're slowly moving towards this energy, and the guidance here is is all about staying high vibrational, staying grounded, okay, and communication. So as long as I feel like spirit is telling you to stay high vibe, stay grounded, stay warm, stay open, um, remaining, um, you know, embody a, a, a more feminine, divine feminine nature, spirit and energy, and really 
communicate, okay? Um, and really communicate for this connection, this connection that you're slowly moving towards um, for it to be a solid connection. Because I feel like, like I said, you've been manifesting this. You have definitely been manifesting it. Let's get a final tarot. Okay. Justice. Yeah. The justice card. Okay. Karmic justice. This is due to you. I feel like this connection has been, you've been working hard towards this connection or you've had connections in the past where it didn't work out and you've been left in, you know, you've been hurt. You've been left hurt a lot. Leo. And so now we're coming into this new connection and it's going to be fresh. It's going to be new. It's going to be loving. It's going to be a lot of communication. It's going to be healthy. And this is all part of your just do, your karm karmic justice. All right. Now I'm going to pull a card from the divine feminine deck and see which feminine energy is going to step forward for Leo. All right, which feminine energy is going to step forward for Leo? Let me cut the deck. Mm, this came out before. Um, Ananda Maima, Ananda Maima, Ananda Maima. I am my own guru. I know the that. Uh, I know the self that never changes, okay? And her message is, if I seem to remember, she is really about embodying oneself and connecting with one's soul, no matter what it is that's going on on the outside, knowing that the love for, that you have for yourself, the relationship that you have for yourself, your soul connection never changes, okay? No matter what is going on around you, knowledge of self, self-love, connection with your soul, that is what never changes. And um, to always keep that in mind and move from that space, okay, Leo? All right, so one last card. I want to see what spirit wants you to surrender to or let go of in this time. What does let's get a card for Leo? Surrender negative thinking. That means let go of the negative thinking. You have control over your thoughts. When negative thoughts surface, say thank you for sharing and quickly refocus on positive affirmations. All right, so. Leo, you're being guided to surrender the negative self-talk, let go of the negative emotions and thoughts. And when you feel those negative thoughts coming, just quickly switch them over to pod positive affirmations. I know it's easier said than done, but try it. Try some mirror work. Look into the mirror um, and tell yourself, say self, I love you, or you're beautiful, or look at how beautiful you are today. Um, you know, something positive, something affirming, and do it in the mirror and look yourself directly into the mirror, okay? So that's the message uh, for today, Leo. Let me know in the comments what you think. Like the video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you'd like a personal Book that on my website, martinefelton.com. And as always, I love you for watching and I'll see you next time.